Hi everybody. Welcome to leg day. Julie Miller here from Premier Fitness. We've got leg day going on. Got to turn off my volume so nobody doesn't call me. So we got five exercises. We're doing these five exercises. See how many times we can get through them. But first, before we get to that, hold that thought. I forgot my cheat sheet. I want you to like the Ashtabula County Medical Center on Facebook. As usual, like us, love us. You'll be notified anytime we go live with any kind of content on Facebook. And also we have our next walk with a doc coming up. This is Daniel Marshall. There we go. He will be talking about dealing with stress and anxiety. This walk with a doc is at noon next Wednesday, June 16th at Lakeshore Park, the big pavilion down there. Don't forget, mark your calendars. You can talk to him about anything you want, dealing with stress and anxiety and coping techniques and breathing techniques and all kinds of crazy stuff. All right, walk with the doc next June, next thir Wednesday, June 16th at noon. Okay, so enough of that, we'll put that away. How's everybody feeling tonight? I got, like I said, I've got these five exercises. We're gonna run through them see where we're at with time, maybe run through them one or two more times. Two is my goal. I'd like to get through at least two sets. Three, I, uh, it's hard to get three in, in a half an hour period when I'm chit chatting a lot. But let's get started. Let's get the warm up going on. So we're gonna inhale our arms up, exhale, bend from those hips, bring it down, sweep the floor, inhale, arms up. Exhale, bend from those hips again. So we're stretching out the back of those legs a little bit dynamically. You can have your knees slightly bent. My knees are slightly bent. And bring it up. How about one more? And bring it down, sweep the floor. Inhale, bring it up. From here, I want you to stretch each side of the body. I want you to feel this stretch all the way from your armpits all the way down to that knee. So we're just stretching. We're keeping moving, getting the blood flowing. One more this side and drop those hands down. All right, next move, standing cat cow. So I'm gonna stand to the side so you can see this movement. I'm gonna round my back, gaze between my feet, and I'm gonna hunch, drop my belly, gaze up to the ceiling. Again, round your back, this is cow pose. And drop your belly. Actually, this is cow pose. This is cat pose when you round your back. So I'm also moving my shoulders back and forth, moving my elbows just to get with the fun. We're just creating space in the spine, getting all the juices flowing. One more round. So we're going to round our back, and now we're going to drop our belly, and we're going to stand up. Nice work. We're going to take a little bit, what do you call these? A little, like, Marching in place, what a brain fog. Marching in place, bring those feet out to the side. Go ahead and take your arms up. A little bit of cardio, we're just doing some side taps. Good, three, two, and one. Drop it down, arms out to a T. Feet are nice and wide, we're just gonna twist back and forth. So more manipulating that spine. Let your hip go where they may. As long as your knees are slightly bent, we don't want to torque the knee unnaturally in any way. Good, three, two, and one, and bring it down. Feet together, do some little pop squats. So standing, as I'm standing, I'm pushing through my heels and I'm really squeezing my butt together and sending my hands backwards. Good. This is a little quarter squat, a little pop squat. Good. Three, two, and one. I'm gonna take it over to the side. Stand up, knee, hip roll, I mean. Back to the side again, stand up, big giant hip roll. To the right, stand up, hip roll. These are so weird for me. They feel funny, but they feel good. That's why I do. Woo! Takes a little bit of balance on this one. This is the last one right here. Hip roll, perfect. I'm gonna stand on the side. You can face me. I'm just gonna tap backwards, really stretching. 
that leg to tap backwards. Nice. So this is like a really slow motion reverse running man. <laughs> all right, one more. Perfect. All right, first move, now that everybody's all warmed up, is a plie squat. This will work the inner thighs. So if you channel your inner ball, ballerina, feet are gonna be about hip width distance apart. Maybe a little wider. Maybe shoulder width. Shoulder? Yeah, shoulder. Feet are in 10 and 2. So this is like a sumo squat, but when you're standing back up, I really want you to engage the inner thighs and really push up. Really putting your mind over those inner thighs. Kind of like they're, you're splitting your thighs together and you're zipping them back up again. So as usual, your butt squeezes at the top. Take the mind, work those inner thigh muscles, making sure those knees track over those toes. Squeeze, I lost count. So we're just gonna keep going until I say stop. Track those knees out, zip it up. Let's do four more, zip it up. Three more, how low can you go? Two more, and this last one, then bring it up. Keeping your feet right there, drop those knees down and we're gonna hold it here. Now we're gonna pulse, pulse, perfect. Five, four, three, two, and one and stand nice and gently, perfect. Go ahead and heel toe those feet in. Next move, so we have a side lunge, stand it up with a side kick, all right? So we're gonna do it on each one side the first way. Side lunge, side kick, side lunge, side kick. We'll call this four, five, Six, keep your core nice and tight, helps with your balance. Seven, we're going for 12. Nine, 10, two more. Now, if you can't necessarily do the side kick, then just hold it. Last one right here. Perfect. Keep those feet, give that right leg a rest right to their side, so we're gonna stretch it out. Stand, side kick. Again, side kick. This is three, woo, four. Keeping those toes and knees in the same plane. Now, like I said, if you can't side kick, then just hold it. Eight. Wow, my counting is Woohoo today. That's 10. Two more. Side kick. I forgot to do the side kick, didn't I? And side kick. That's all right. All right. Shake it out. Next up is going to be a side lunge. Oh, I'm sorry, a stationary lunge with a rear kick. So I'm going to stand the side to show you this. Stepping forward with my right leg, left leg goes back. We're going to lunge, stand. Forward, a little kick in the back. 12 on each side, so we're gonna lunge, stand, forward and kick. So my spine is nice and straight. Kick, this is five, six, seven. Try to be nice and soft with that foot release. Good, nine, Two more. Woo. Last one. Oh, that was rough one. That last one was hard. Shake everything out. We're gonna go to the other side. So I'm gonna step forward with my right foot. Step back, back with my left. We're gonna lunge up and kick. Give us a step back. This is two and kick. Three, core is nice and tight, shoulders are relaxed, five, whew. six, nice quick kicks. Now if you need a wall or a chair to hold on, 
Go for it. Eight. Nine. That's 10. Two more. Last one right here. Ah. Whew. Shake that out. All right. Next exercise is we alternate curtsy squats. So a curtsy squat is, I'm gonna move this over a little bit. So I'm putting all my weight on my left leg, taking my right leg, bring it behind my left, and I'm bending both legs, and up center, and over to the other side. Left leg behind right, and we squat. Good. Just alternating back and forth. Nice control. Trying to keep your upper body as erect as possible. Good. This is five. Six, we're shooting for 10. Seven. Step eight. Step nine. And step 10. Nice work. Go ahead and shake out those legs. Grab a drink, I forgot to tell you to get water. Go grab some water really quick. Grab a drink. Whew. And we're gonna do it again. Ah. Whatever you're doing during this little break, just keep your body moving. Keep everything moving. So after this workout, after leg day, I'm gonna do a 20 minute hip class here on Facebook. Feel free to join me. I usually upload the, all the videos that we do here at Premiere onto our YouTube page. So go ahead and look for that. If there's a favorite one you had, go back and do it again. All right, are we ready to start with those plia, plia, plia squats? So feet are about shoulder width distance apart. This is the one where we're thinking about our inner thighs. So go ahead and track those knees over those toes. Engage your inner thighs, zip it up. That's one. Zip for two, squeezing your butt at the top. That's three, nice work. Upper body is nice and erect. Five, six, squeeze that butt. Good, eight, let's do two more. Nine, squeeze, plie, and 10, nice job. All right, shake it out. Exercise two, we're gonna side lunge to a side kick. So if you need a chair, grab a chair. Do all, we're gonna do one side 12 times and the other side for 12 times as well. So starting, stepping out with my left leg, side lunge, stand it up with a side kick. So if you don't wanna do the side kick, just hold your balance. Like I cannot do. Up, side kick. It's four. Good. Do whatever you wanna do with your arms to keep balance. We got six, halfway there, seven. Ooh, I can feel these. It's burning. Eight. There's nine. <laughs> and 10. Two more. Make this one your last. And side kick. Shake everything out. Just keep everything moving. Other side, 12 reps. Bring it down and up, kick. This is two, three, four. Core is nice and tight, helps with that balance. Five, six, almost there, seven. Eight, nine, keep smiling. This has gotta be my most unfavorite exercise. All right, let's do one more, just because it's not my favorite. Whew. All right, shake it out. Next move, that lunge with that rear kick. So I'm gonna step forward this time with my left foot, step back with my right. That right foot is popped, that right ankle is popped. Bend both legs, stand up, bend forward, kick it back. One, 
two, bend both legs, three, upper body is nice and straight, four, five, Woo. six, seven, keep smiling, eight, I think there's a bug in here, nine, and you're buzzing, ten, two more, last one, nice work, take those nice high knees, we'll marches in place, other side, so right foot forward, left foot back, that left heel is popped, we're going to bend both knees, step forward and kick for one, bend, two, three, whatever you need to do with your arms, do it, five, six, whew, seven, over halfway there, nine, ten, two more, last one, Ooh, nice, nice work. My shoe is becoming a tie. I'll just tuck it in there. All right, last exercise. 10 curtsy squats, five on each side. So I'm putting all the weight this time on my right leg. Step back behind with my left. Curtsy squat, bring it to the other front. This is the last little segment of this workout. Last little segment of leg day. If you liked it, you can go back and do it again. No crying in that. All right, we got two more on each side. Ideally, I'd like to get three sets in, but for some reason it doesn't work out for me. Last one each side and bring it on over and curtsy squat and shake it out. Nice work. Get a drink of water. Just keep moving, drink, keep moving, just keep moving. We're gonna start a quick little cool down stretch right now. I'm gonna grab a drink. All right, nice work. So we're gonna take a nice little march, nice little march in place. Take your arms, inhale them up, exhale them down through center. Nice, deep exhale. Again, inhale through your nose or mouth. Now exhale only through your mouth. Last one, bring it up. We're still marching those feet. Exhale through your mouth. Perfect, bring those feet to stillness. About shoulder width distance apart. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, swan dive it down. Relax your head, your neck, and your shoulders. Rest your hands on your shins or your thighs, never your knees. Perfect. Relaxing everything up top with that stress roll right off the back of your body. Perfect. Now, knees bent, chin to chest, roll it up nice and slow. <sighs> nice work. Turning to the side, I'm gonna use a wall, or you can do this with your own balance. Left foot forward, right foot back. I'm going to place my hands on my left thigh, stretch out the back of that right leg. So my goal here is to be trying to put my right heel on the floor. Now, it's not going to get there. It's not going to get there for me. So but the action is what the stretch is doing. Perfect. Bring your knee together. Switch it around. Shoot that left heel back. Bend that right knee. Support yourself on that right leg. Shooting that right, that left heel to the floor to get that stretch. Perfect. And bring it forward. Taking that right heel down, bending forward, getting that stretch right here. So you have to bend forward from your hips as, as far as you can to get that stretch. Whenever you feel it, that's when you, that's when you pause. And bring it up. Other heel, left heel down. 
bending forward, bending my right leg, keeping my left leg straight. Nice stretch. Perfect. Nice work. Inhale those arms up. Exhale them down through center. Thank you immensely for joining me for leg day. I'll see you back here in about three minutes. We will begin 20 minute hit. Grab a drink of water and I will see you in a few.